Hey, what's going on guys? Uh, Ren's Life here. Um, small update video, I'm gonna keep this one short and sweet. I got a package in the mail. Wonder what's gonna be in it, stay tuned, find out. Alright, so let's see what's in it. Notice it came in a sick, Ray Best is break that box. Let's see what's in it. Cue Zelda music. So, as you just can see, it is a torque adapter made by the company called Ingalls. I N G A L. Who cares? What it is is uh, it's supposed to be like an engine mount kind of thing. They'll take up my end frame. Take up some dampening here. I'm going to show you guys how to install this and make this because this right here was ordered for a Civic or something. I got an Accord so it seems like everything on that car you got to make so we'll figure out a way to do this. Um, also I was kind of curious what's inside one of these things. So that's what we're going to figure out today. So I'm going to blow this apart. Let's see what's inside of it. What actually makes it work. Use some good old standard tools. That's cute. So this is what we got after exploding it all apart here. This is a main body. We just got a hard white piece of plastic there. And inside we got this black bushing. This one feels like a, just a hard plastic. This one feels like a poly, like same thing as an end link. It actually looks like, if you look close to it, it actually has the same taper like a end link bushing does like off a truck. If you're familiar with like Chevy's Fords, whatever. Um, threaded fittings that go into the body than the two Himes at the end. So not much R&D that looks like it goes into it. So like a Chinese, I, this is a type of part that I wouldn't be scared buying Chinese. This right here is supposed to be a name brand. I bought it secondhand. I'm just gonna put this together. I just took it apart just to clean it and lube everything up here, but I'm gonna just put that back together. I was just kind of curious <laughs> what it was. So there you go. So guys, forgot to mention that this guy right here, this little lock nut, you can actually tighten it and that'll tell you how much that'll actually adjust the amount of dampening here. So we've got a little bit of play. We can take this out and have a little bit more play. That's just, you could design that however the hell you want it. All right guys, it was just a quick video on how one of these things work. If you want to see me put this in, I'm going to be putting it in my channel. The video will be dropping a little bit later this week. Um, if you haven't done so already, look through my channel. If you guys want to subscribe, look through my videos and if you want to do so, then do so. If this video keeps you guys entertained for the time being, drop a like on that. It'll help me out. Um, if not, let me know what you guys think. Dumb way to end this shit. <laughs>